What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Blue Chago back with another video. Man, it's been a while, but I appreciate you guys still watching. Uh, today's tutorial, man, this has been a, a, a requested video on my channel. Today, we're going to be learning how to change anybody's moveset in Dragon Ball Z Universe 2. Now, this includes original characters uh, already in the game and modded characters. So if you need to change anybody's moveset, you're about to learn today. And I just want to say thank you for the support. I've seen our channel been growing. And, uh, despite me not being active as much, um, you guys are still commenting and asking questions, so that's good. If you have any questions, it'd be the best time now to comment down below. That way I can get to you as soon as possible. But all right, man, let's just dive into it. No time wasted. Um, we're we're going to get right into it. So step one, pick a character's moveset to change and a character moveset that you're using. So for example, today I'm going to be changing my female Saiyan's moveset to Ultra Instinct Goku's moveset. I'm going to change my female Saiyan's moveset to, to UI Goku's. Step two is go ahead and download the CMS editor. I have this in the, the link in the description. Go ahead and click the link, download, and open up the file. So go ahead and click the link in the description and you're gonna see the CMS editor folder. Just go ahead and download that. Um, go ahead and open that up. Now, step three is to click file then open now you want to go ahead and locate this file and to find this file you need to go to your Dragon Ball Xenomers 2 folder click data go to system and it should be right there okay so if you have any problems with that just let me know down below this is where it's located and click open you shouldn't see anything pop up once you click this arrow on the bar, three-letter coding should appear. Now, guys, what this is, is this three-letter coding is all the characters installed in the game. Okay. Step three is done. So step four, you want to go ahead and locate to your XV2 character create. Mine is located in the Dragon Ball Xenos 2 folder. It's right here. So go ahead and click this and open this up. All right. Now click on files up top. And then click on the change button across from select portrait. Okay. And then you're going to select copy from game. Okay, from here, this is where you see all the three letter codings in the game. And it even shows you which character it is. So you don't get any confused. All right, so what I say, this video, we're gonna be modding my female Saiyan. So that coding is SYF. Leave this open, that way you have a visual, of which character is which. Okay, so Ultra Instinct Goku is the character I'm I'm using now step five is going to be locating the character moveset I'm changing and the character moveset I'm using. So female Saiyan's three letter coding is SYF and the ultra instinct Goku's three letter coding is going to be uh, FOK. Step five is to make sure you remember the three letter coding for the character you're changing and the character you're using. Go ahead and open up your notes and write this down. F, F, okay. Now step six, step six, you're gonna locate the three letter code for both characters through the CMS editor. So we're gonna go back here. CMS editor is open. Now I'm gonna locate my female Saiyan, the character I'm changing. Okay. okay, now this is my female Saiyan, the SYF, 
If you're changing your female saying like I am, uh, then it should look like this, exactly like this. You want to go ahead and make sure you take a picture um, of the CMS page. That way you have a backup of it if you need to change it back. Okay, guys, so I'm using my snipping tool on Windows. So I'm going to go ahead and click New. And I'm going to take a screenshot of the my female sayings coding page. And you can go ahead and save. And that way, right. yeah. Now make sure you take a screenshot of both characters. That way you have a backup. I'm taking a screenshot of UI Goku. Okay, guys. So that was step six. Is make sure you take a screenshot of the, the coding page. That way you have a backup. Now step seven. We're going to go to uh, the character move set that we're changing so the character we're changing is my female saiyan and if you're doing a female saiyan like me it should look exactly like this so step seven is making sure you're on the character's move set you're changing so step eight step eight you're going to go ahead and rename these files the only files that need to be renamed are the following okay that's going to be the cam in the in the player dot BAC player dot BCM and the player dot BDM every you do not touch anything else now you need to use the three letter code for the characters move set you're using so in order to change my female Saiyans move set to UI Goku's I need to locate UI Goku's three letter coding so three letter code for Goku, we have it right here on our notes. It's F O K. So in order to rename, I'm going to put dot dot slash F O K. Oops. Slash F O K. If you do not do this, it will not work. Okay. You need to make sure it's exactly like this. All right, the, the coding doesn't need to be the same. This is just for Goku. And you want to do this for the following files. You want the cam in, the in, player.bac, player.bcm, player.bdm. And I'm going to do the same thing for the rest. Dot, dot, slash, F-O-K, slash, F-O-K. And you can just copy paste. Right? Okay, guys, so I'm done. Now... I went ahead and renamed the three letter coding for Goku on all the files, except for character 14 uh, question mark and the AI. Do not touch anything else. After you're done, step nine, you're going to click file and then save. And you're done. That's it guys. After you're done, you're going to go ahead and load up the game. And uh, my female Saiyan should have UI Goku's moveset. Okay guys, now we're loaded up in the game. Now we're going to go to my female Saiyan. And here she goes. She has Ultra Instinct Goku's moveset. Now, one thing I will say is that um, there might be some a little bit, a little bit glitches or bugs. Um, like, for example, her face, her mouth is kind of weird, but everything else should work. Whispering. Oh, all right, guys, we're loading up. Intro looks nice. All right, this is it, guys. Look at this. Oh, oh, oh! And there you go. My female Saiyan has ultra instinct Goku moveset. But as you can see, guys, my female Saiyan has Ultra Instinct Goku Musa. I'm going to go ahead and show a couple other examples of how I modded 
Uh, how do I switch the movesets? Here's Vegito's move set. This is the end of the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions, just leave in the comments down below. Other than that, you have a great rest of your day, and Blue Jago is out. Peace, y'all. Peace.